Wins is based. Hey, everybody, this is Boog Shabby. Welcome to the show. Welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. MLB The Show brings you Diamond Dynasty Baseball. It's Texas taking on San Francisco. Ready to go? Now it's the second baseman, Gavin Lux. The second baseman, Gavin Lux. Here comes a pitch. Bunted back towards the mound. Sends it to Vogel back. One up, one down. Now the number two hitter, Robin Yell. This is a guy you got to keep an eye on when he digs in. Definitely been known to drop a drag bunt from time to time, and he's pretty good at it, Chris. Yeah, and he creates a sense of urgency for the defense because of the speed, because of the ability to put down that bunt. And he takes it himself for the out. Number 32, Evan... Harder. Lays down a bunt to the right side. Flips it behind his back. Yeah. On target. He got him. Nice play. And we're back. And now the center fielder, Ricky Henderson. The center fielder, Ricky. Henderson. And a pitch. And oh. takes low for ball one. Paul, a 6-2 southpaw. He features a four-seam fastball, a slider, a changeup, and he occasionally uses a curve. Horowitz. And he's safe at first. Some strange defense there. Here's Carlos Correa. Carlos. Correa, the former first overall pick from Puerto Rico. Ricky on the move. No, that Pitch miss, misses inside. Man, is he fast. That is so fun to watch. No throw. He's in there safely. Next offering way off the plate. Chopped 
check yeah. swing did he go yes he did Two what and there's a hit around third he scores and they have the lead one nothing not stopping he's going for three Correa on his horse and coming home but now he hits the brakes and hustles back to third. Well, they strike first as he gets the job done to bring home the run. Just a cookie down the middle. I mean, those are the ones you dream about. The ones in the cage, you're just hoping you get in the ball game. Right down the middle, not a whole lot of velocity, right on top of it. Here's the former MVP, Jose Altuve. And it's a one hopper off the wall. Should be extra bases. In comes the runner from third. It's 2 0. Doesn't stop. Heads for home. Safe at no, home is that. two score on the inside the park homer. Kyle Seeger will hit next. Swing and a deep drive. This one's got a chance. Way back there. And boom goes the dynamite. They go back to back. It's 4 0. Mitch Garver up to hit here. And first offering is fouled off. Well, they've been able to score four runs off of him in this inning, and this is where you want to just max out, get as much as you can, give him one of those tough innings where it's going to be hard for him to recover in the next one. Hard ground ball base now. Now he'll turn for second. Garber on his way to third. Coming home. Safe. He comes all the way around for an inside the park homer on a ground ball. And man, defensive drills should be fun tomorrow. Now a chance for Tim Salmon. And I don't know what's going on there, but he's safe at first. And at first, Jacob Wilson now at the plate. Singh, you talk about a guy that has all the skills. The range is really good, but the arm just stands out, and he makes all the plays. And that one hops the wall. Around third. One run is in. The throw in. Now batting Mitch Hanniger. Bounced up the middle, and it finds its way through for a hit. Around first, digging for two. Round second, digging for third. He's not stopping, on his way home. He is saved! And a run-of-the-mill grounder turns into an inside-the-park home run. Not a proud moment for the defense. Here's Daniel Vogel back. And no throw for some reason as he reaches first. That's got to be an error. Now Here's the center fielder, center fielder, Ricky Henderson. Ricky. He's 0 for 1. Henderson. Right yeah. down the chute, 0 and 1. Well, he had a pretty good look at that pitch and not sure exactly what tied him up there. Couldn't pull the trigger. The and perhaps the best pitch you'll see in this at bat to hit. That one nope. misses, and yeah, that's ball two. Two He's ball, been trying to strike. tease the zone with that slider, but these hitters have showed patience not going outside the strike zone. That's Breaking ball, ball inside, and that's ball three. That's a really good take right there. Slider down and in. Very difficult to get on the same yeah. plane and do anything with. Full count. The pitch. Goes down, swinging for the strikeout. Had him out front for strike three. Now Correa up to hit. This is a true five-tool guy. Not very many of them out there, but when he's on the field, you can't take your eye off of him. Fans come to the ballpark to watch him play. And in baseball, to have such a talented player going out there every day and putting on the show that he does, just a joy to watch. Bunch attempt, but that goes foul. 
It's for average power, the ability to feel the arm, and then the speed. Really impressive. Hacks and misses. It's a strikeout. The bat. The second baseman. Jose Altuve okay. up to it here. He's already okay. homered here in this one. Kelly makes the catch, and that'll do it. And welcome back to the ballpark. Second inning set to go. And now the center fielder, Seth Brown. Well, every pitcher wants a run support, and having a lead is nice, but it can be challenging for some pitchers. I think keeping the mindset to attack instead of trying to be too fine and have too much finesse go after hitters and get quick outs first Ball. pitch misses lighter One he's the out. kind of starter that a lot of pitching coaches and managers as well really appreciate not a guy who's going to get himself into uh -huh. trouble by Ball. dancing around by walking guys two balls no strikes The 2 0 is in for a strike. Yeah, he throws strikes, and, you know, he's got the command be in the zone, be effective, but just moving the ball around, getting the ball Ooh. back from the catcher, Boog, and throwing the pitch. Left hand hitter waits. Got it. Right. And there's one down. This is Dylan Carlson. Just missed. It's an interesting One thing ball, no when you consider limiting walks. Is it more important today because of how many home runs no, are being down. hit? Ball. No doubt. Keeping players off the base pass with the way the swings and the launch angles are today, the emphasis of hitting home runs is so huge. It's never been more important the wind and the pitch yeah I think the other part though as well as it goes both ways because I think that pitchers at times are more than willing to give up walks because they'll come back and strike yeah, the next ball. guy out and another ball fastball in for a strike and it's a full count one down, base is empty. Got him looking, and he didn't like the call. And now, Spencer Horowitz. Fell off to a great start. He's really cruising out there on the mound. He's got a chance to get through these first two innings with under 20 pitches. Ball. That could set him up to go deep into this game. Two outs, base is empty. Right through there for a strike. That's excellent location on the fastball right there early in this game. If he can do that all game, should be a good outing for him. That yeah. one finds the zone and a count one and two. Hey. Got him looking. And it's a three up, three down inning. Bottom of the second, Leading and here is Kyle Seager. Seager, the designated hitter. Kyle Seager. The pitch. Swung out, belted. Deep. That one went back there, and that one's going to land not so much here, but here. A gigantic blast. His second home run of the game, and they boost their lead. It's 9-0.
And now Mitch Garver splits the plate. That's strike one. Oh and one. Tap one dances out of the way of that one. Nobody on, nobody out with a run in. Bottom half of inning number two. And he drops it down the third baseline. So digging in, Tim Salmon. Outfield playing very deep, not wanting anything over their heads. There's a strike. Bottom of the zone and a called strike. Good approach right there. You want to get something just a little higher that you can elevate. Elevate, stay out of that double play. Nobody out, runner at first. That misses no, the zone. Hit. Now one and two. Well, he's not afraid to fall into a two-strike count. Knows the strike zone very well, so much so that I think umpires will look at him and determine whether it's a ball or strike, if he swings or not. Now batting. Third base. Here's the third baseman, Jacob Wilson. He's already Wilson. homered in this game. That one at 95 high. missed up nope, top, and that's ball one. And he gets back in. Man at first, one away. Missed oh. inside with the curve. 2-0. Oh. And there's the ah. strike. Nasty 2-0 slider there for a strike. That tells you he's got a lot of confidence in that pitch. And that's oh, a little huh. bit high. Three and one. All and right. strike two. Full count. Three, two now. Right. And down on strikes. Two down. Man at first. Yeah, Stepping in no the long field. ball threat, Mitch yeah. Hanniger. One for one with a double and a run score. And a good nope. eye there. Oh. Garver stands at second with two gone. Inside oh, just missed. Well, no need to go right at this guy. First base is open. He can hurt you. So make him expand his zone. If he doesn't, give him a walk. And he lays one down the left side.
now batting. First base. Daniel Vogel back at the plate. Vogel. Swing and a miss. That's Your strike one. Strike. Swings right through that one out in front that time. Oh two. Kelly left that change up up. Got away with one there, and he'll take it, but doesn't want to make that mistake again. Swings through that, and it's a strikeout. That ends the inning and stops things from getting out of hand. And we're back, and now the DH, Yuli Gurriel. Lighter back to work. Right through there for a strike. Clearly down in this ball game, and you can't look at the deficit and try to get it all back in one swing. It's got to come one at bat at a time and even right shrink two. it down smaller, pitch to pitch. Make that guy on the mound work to get you out. Going two now. Goes down looking. And now it's switch hitting third baseman Ildemaro Vargas. And the no, first pitch low. misses ball. for ball one. Right, right through there for a strike. One down, base is empty. Good eye that right missed. there. That's in there. And now two and two. And the right hander deals. Got him looking for the K. And now the batter is Carson Kelly. That's in for a strike. Next Ball offering outside. is outside. Right yeah. down the chute, and that is strike two. One ball, two strikes. And there's no, a ball. Down. It's a good ball. take. The pitch. Got him looking. That's a strikeout. As we go to the last of the third, here's the center fielder, Ricky Henderson. And a pitch. And first offering is fouled off. And if there's one man you want to keep off the base paths, it's this guy right here, Ricky Henderson, the undisputed stolen base king. And a pitch. Yeah. 
No throw. He's safe at first. And here comes Carlos Correa. Struck out on just three pitches last time. Correa. That one not close. And that's ball one. Well, these guys showing great discipline at the plate, and patience definitely seems to be the name of their game in this one. Not only have they already put up a bunch of runs on the board, but they've also made the starter work really hard out there. Vargas. Like I said, his pitch count is high, so I got to expect they'll be turning to their bullpen sooner now than they had hoped. The Here's a big power threat. Okay. Jose Altuve. Oh. One for two. Bounce takes it over the fence for an automatic double. A run comes in on the play. Next is the designated hitter, Kyle Seeger. Base hit, one run in already. Another comes in to score. Runner around third on his way to the plate. Safe at the plate. It's a three-run inside the park home run. Now the catcher up to hit, Mitch Garver. First no, pitch, and he just misses. Four runs already in the frame here in the last half of the third. Next Two pitch misses way outside. Well, a really rough inning out there on the mound. And uh, this is one of those where you learn a lot about a guy's toughness and his ability to turn the page and keep pressing forward. That's a hit. And that's going to get into the corner. Makes the turn and heads for second. Pulls in with a double. Third hit for him today. And now the right fielder, Tim Salmon. Popped up. Kelly hauls it in, and there's one away. Well, he gave the bunt a shot there, but not able to execute. Yeah, I think he rushed it a little bit, and when guys rush, it can be a pop-up or can be bunted right back at a position player. Wilson in the box with one away as he takes ball one. One out and a runner at second. Go Chris through the early stages. He hasn't been very efficient in Give terms of the pitch count. He's going to need to get some quick outs if he's going to get deeper into this game. Man at second. Carter makes the grab two away down. It is interesting, though, 
when you consider the way the game is run now doesn't even matter that much if your starter doesn't go that deep because teams are really aggressively building their bullpens. Hanniger, the next to hit, takes ball one. One and out. Brown on the move. Dives, but it falls. And now it looks like extra bases. Run comes in from second. It's 14-0. Safe at third with a triple. His third hit of the day. Comes through with the RBI. Really nice job to take that inside pitch and pull it into the gap. He could have easily spun off of it or just been tied up. He stayed short to the baseball. Oh. And he was thinking triple right out of the box. Vogel back. Stands in with two away as he takes a ball. Next two pitch, up. not close, up high. Clearly didn't come out of his hand the right way. Left that curveball way up. Next no, offering ball. upstairs. Let's see if he gives him anything to hit here. Base hit, and a run comes in. And that's going to roll to the wall. Now around second, going for third. Now a long throw home. And he's in safely at third. And a run comes in to score. He was all over that one. Everything was on time and fluid in that swing. Got a pitch he could get the barrel on and lined it into center for the knock. Those always feel good. Now the batter now, Ricky Henderson. Yeah, right through there for a strike. Vogel back on third with two out. Yeah. And no throw for some reason as he reaches first. And on the play, a run will come in to score. Well, now here's Carlos Correa with a chance to hit. One for three. Inside and it hit him. Better kick your base. So, Boog, if you had to take one for the team, where would you want to get hit? Chris, I think I'd have to say upper hamstring. Standing in is the power hitting second baseman, Jose Altuve. RBI knock for him last time. Now a chance to drive in another run. Fun attempt popped up. And they get Altuve for the out. And that's the third out. All set for the start of the inning. Here's the second baseman, Gavin Lux. Gavin Lux. The wind of the pitch. Lux measures six feet two inches, 26 years old, and he's one of the few players in Major League Baseball born in Wisconsin. That one misses. One and one. One and one. Wouldn't chase Ball. that time. Two balls, one strike. Next Back offering two. is in for a strike. Two seam fastball has been very consistent. He's been able to throw it to both sides of the plate and some really good arm side run. Nope. Good Ball. eye in that spot. Really good Down take, especially with two strikes. Right hander kicks deals. Got him looking, and he did not like the call. And now it's going to be Robin yeah. Yell. 0 for 1 so far. And that ball missed, one. Ball. One ball, no strike. Next no, pitch is not. outside. Pretty easy to give up on that pitch right there. Started on the edge of the plate with the spin. You know it's going to finish well off the plate. Inside yeah. corner for a strike, and it's 2-1. Two two one. One. Just oh, missed. Oh. Here's an opportunity to do some damage and perhaps unlock this offense. 3-1 count. Be ready to turn on a fastball. And now it's filled up. We got a full count. Yeah. 
He goes down looking. Two outs, bases empty. Evan Carter digs in now. He's 0 for 1. That one finds the zone. Going one. Two down, nobody on. Top half of inning number four. Hey, there's a breaking ball that drops in there. Got him! And that's nine in a row. Well, this one ends in a blowout for Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show. I'm John Shambi. We'll see you soon. Time the ball game. baseball fans and welcome diamond dynasty baseball coming your way on the show it's new york taking on san francisco now it's the power speed combo byron buxton and he deals swings through that it's zero and one next offering misses down and away Kicks and fires. And that is cut on and missed. And the count one and two. One and two. Cuts and misses. It's a strikeout. One down. Here comes Cody Bellinger. And ball one to the right fielder. Bellinger's won a variety of awards in his career, hasn't he? I mean, he's been named Rookie of the Year, MVP, 
and comeback player of the year now. Throwing a few Silver Slugger awards, and he has himself quite the trophy cabinet. One down, base is empty. Ball. Good slider down and in can be Good so one. hard to get on plane with. You're better off taking that pitch. That Ball. one misses, and now three and one. One out, base is empty. Good plate appearance four, there. Able to take the walk. Now batting Jamer Candelario. Well, he tried to nibble right there and just missed his spot. Hitter didn't offer at it. Now he has somebody to worry about over at first. The 1-0. Now one missed. Last two pitches have been down in the zone. Pitcher clearly trying to get that ground ball double play. But in this count, he's going to have to give in, elevate his pitches, and get back into this at bat. Next pitch misses. And now three balls and a strike. And that one is lifted in the air. Sizes this one up. He's got it. And there are two outs. Every day during batting practice, these outfielders get about 10 minutes of balls in the gaps. They practice this, and when the game comes, they make the play perfectly. Mike Who? Napoli, now in the box, comes up no empty ball. with One a strike. swing there. And yeah, that's outside. And yeah, the count even one and one. Bellinger off of first with two away. Swing and a miss, struck him out, and that is that. Bottom of the first, and now the center fielder, Ricky Henderson. The pitch. Gets the bunt down the right side, and he picks it up in foul territory. The wide to kick the pitch. Drilled out towards left center field. That's well struck. Buxton sprinting after it. One down. Here's Carlos Correa. Singy's That's currently the team leader in runs batted in. Correa. That misses. Ball. ball one. The guy at the plate could recognize slider out of the hand. Didn't stay in the tunnel very long in terms of depth and perception. He one knew right away straight. it was an off-speed pitch. Swings through that one. One and two. Swing and a miss. Some high cheese for strike three. Two outs, bases empty. Now at the plate, Jose Altuve. Swing and a miss as he was out front that time. Hammers that one deep left field and forget it. A massive home run. It's 1-0. So now it's the four-hole hitter, Kyle Seeger. And first offering is fouled off. Foul ball. And makes the grab. And that will end the inning. Top of the second, Cattell Marte up to the plate. The second baseman, Cattell Marte. DeGrom back to work. Boog, it's always fun showing up to the ballpark on a day DeGrom is pitching. He's widely regarded as one of the most dominant pitchers in the league. And when he's at his best, he's setting the standard for the entire league. Righty to the plate. Got him swinging. Brad Miller now. The shortstop takes the ball. Just no, that missed. That's the ball. One down, base is empty. 
just that's missed. Ball, that's the ball. And a foul ball. The 3 1. And that's ball, ball four. four runner, it's tough break. after falling behind a hitter, two balls and no strikes, but now at least he gets a fresh start against a new batter. But he needs to get back into the strike zone and start pitching with conviction. Here's Taylor Trammell. Check swing. Did he go? Oh, yes, one. he did. Next Back offering two. is in for a strike. Tying run is at first. Here at the top of the second. Swings Back and misses. And now two gone. And Eugenio Suarez up to hit down. Now this is in the air down the line. And that oh is a foul ball. Two outs. Ball nope. one there. Oh. Swing and a miss two. as he was late. Bringing the cheese on that one. One, two. And right. down on strikes he goes. Ready to go for the last half of the Mitch. inning. And now, Mitch Garver. Mitch. As he turns on the rubber. Garver. And with that good live arm delivers. That's in there, and it's 0-1. As a pitcher, you don't want to throw him get me over fastballs just for strikes. You really need to yeah. command your pitches to this guy at the plate. 0-2. Oh the pitch. Hey. Got him looking. Called strike three and a fastball up in the zone. And now here is Tim Salmon. Swings yeah. through that one for strike one. Oh, one. This one popped up. Marte should have it. Makes the grab. Two down. So up next, Jacob Wilson. And he bunts, but that's a foul ball. Two out spaces empty. Popped up. And a foul ball. And one, one and two. two In the air out to center. Marte pulls it down. And that top half of the third inning and here's the first baseman Anthony Rizzo the wind of the pitch that That's misses ball. ball one Rizzo one hitting ninth in today's lineup and he was a sixth round draft pick back in 2007 and nope. another ball. ball and here it comes and a foul ball Makes the count two and one. Left hand batter waits. And that one hit to That's first. Ball. And he picks it up and he'll put it in his pocket. Righty delivers. Three two Definitely. now. One lace to center and a base hit. Around first, heading for two. The relay, not in time. He's safe. Everything came together for him. You'll often hear the phrase short to it, long through it, and that's a great example of it right there. Got the barrel in the hitting zone early, squared it up with the ball. Oh, this one high and deep, way back there. Goodbye, home run. He flexes his power with that swing, and just like that, they're out front. It's 2-1. Here's Cody Bellinger. He reached out a walk his first time. And there's oh. a ball. It can be tough to bounce back after a big home run, but nobody on, nobody out. You just have to treat it as a fresh inning. 
So two Hello. balls and no strikes to Grom. Maybe a little less aggressive on the mound right now after that home run, Chris. Yeah, it seems that way. You know, pitchers, they can oh. come out, feel good, but then all of a sudden get touched up Real. a little bit, and they start trying to throw instead of pitch. They're not trusting their stuff. Downstairs, four, and it misses base. ball four. That just came apart right there. Four-pitch walk, and guy at the plate was not going to help him out by swinging at something out of the zone. On the ground. And it's through for a hit. Throw back in quickly. First and second now with nobody out. Well, clearly he was ready to hit right there. He kind of rolled over on this pitch a little bit, but he got enough behind it to shoot it through for a knock. And you'll take that anytime you can get him to find a hole. Napoli now at the plate as he swings through strike one. Hey. Swing and a miss. Oh, two. And the next pitch is way outside. Struck him out swinging. Slider got him for strike three. An outstanding hitter in Cattell Marte. And that one fouled off. The last thing he wants is to hit the ball on the ground, but I wouldn't expect many pitches up in the zone. They'll be pitching for a double play in this spot. Into the outfield, base hit. Here's the throw, but it's offline. He will score. Well, he gets it done in a big spot to get the run across. Really nice job staying up the middle with his approach. He didn't try to do too much with the pitch, just shot it through the infield. Stepping in, Brad Miller. That misses the zone, 1-0. and oh. Go Chris through the early stages. He hasn't been very efficient in terms of the pitch count. Ah, ground ball, and that's through the infield. The throw in, but it's offline. Runner holds it third, so just one across on the play. Picks himself up in RBI. Once you get the ball by the pitcher, there's a lot of base hits up the middle, even on ground balls. So a nice job to use that big hole and get himself a hit. Tremell takes a ball as he stands in for the second time. And another ball. It is interesting, though, when you consider the way the game is run now, doesn't even matter that much if you're swinging a ground ball up the middle. That's a base hit. One run is in. Here's the throw to the plate. Save. It's 6-1. Gets the job done as he brings home a pair. Just kept it simple. Played Pepper with the middle of the infield and took it back where it came from. And there's yeah. just no one there to knock it down. Suarez stands in now and watches strike one. One out and a runner at second. We're here in the top half of inning number three. Next down. offering is oh. down low. And the count is one and one. And that one no, is that inside. Is. With how good these offenses are, there's a lot of ball game left. That Whoa. one misses. Now three and one. Three one. Three one Take and he base. couldn't come up with it. You get a walk and you get a walk. Everyone gets a walk, Booth. One down. Stepping in the long ball threat, Anthony Rizzo. And first offering is fouled off. And ball one. And one. one. Sharp grounder. That's through for a base hit. Around third. He will score, and it's now a six-run lead coming home. Now he stops, and he's able to get back into third. Well done. Drives in the run. Got the top of the ball a little bit, but not much. That was hit pretty hard through the infield, so I think he'll be happy with that swing. Definitely generated some good bat speed. Back to the top of the lineup, Byron Buxton getting ready to... Ouch, that, that one guy. got him. Now that lack of execution puts a little pressure on the defense too to try to prevent another run. It's been a rough inning and he's not instilling a lot of confidence oh, on the ball. mound right now. Bellinger in the oh, box ball. here okay. lets that one go for a ball. Ball in the dirt. Nice job behind the plate. Two and oh. All loaded up. Dangerous hitter at the plate. That one spoiled and the count now two and one. Oh. 
swing and a miss. Ugly swing right there. Spoils that one and it remains two and two. Well, he got challenged with a good fastball right there. Just couldn't catch up. And Both another count. ball. He's been trying to tease the zone with that slider, but these hitters have showed patience not going outside the strike zone. This ball four. He's walked in a run. He's really gotten himself into a mess out there and now forces home a run with the wall. This yeah. inning's definitely getting away from him. New arm out of the bullpen, hey, Josh Hader. I think it's got to be a little tough coming in out of the pen when your guys are trailing so big oh. on the scoreboard. Just doesn't have the same wow. intensity to it, but he's got to find a way because these batters count All the right. same for his stats, obviously, one regardless one. of the score. Ray right out front for strike two. Part of the order one coming three. through now, and with one home run already in this inning, they're definitely That's looking to do some more damage. Kicks and deals. Got it. That's out number two. Here's the catcher to hit, Mike Napoli, who's 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts. What? See the velocity 97 with that fastball. And it's ball. even up. Well, he's so great about hitting the ball the other way. He gets those arms extended. So right there, just trying to straighten him up a right little two. bit so he doesn't have as much right outside two. plate coverage. Two outs. Battling here as he fouls it away. Off the Ball. mark there. The count now two and two. That's foul off to the right side. Keeps the A.B. going. He caught it behind his back. Fires to first hey. and they get the out. And welcome back to the ballpark. Set for the bottom of the third. Here's the left fielder, Mitch Hanniger. Swing yeah. and a miss as he was out front. Well, every pitcher Your wants run support, strike. and having a lead is nice, but it can be challenging for some pitchers. Good I run. think keeping the mindset to attack no instead ball. of trying to be strike. too fine and have too much finesse, go after hitters and get quick Eight. outs. Goes down looking. Batting done. Here's Daniel Vogel back. That one fouled off. One down, base is empty. Fouled back our way, and that's out of play. The pitch. Good job to fight that one off. And the pitch. That misses the, the zone. Now one and two. Five foul balls in this at bat so far, and these two are going head to head. You can see the crowd. They're starting to get into it a little bit more and more each pitch, even though there hasn't been a ball in play yet. And a bunt towards third. Throw on to Rizzo. They handle the bunt and get the out. So digging in, Ricky Henderson. 0 for 1 with a fly out to center. And he lays down a bunt. Marte. And he's safe at first. Some strange defense there. Runner at first with two away. Carlos Correa, the next to hit. And there's a foul ball. Runner, runner, runner. Ricky runs. Hey. Swing and a miss. Safe at second with a stolen base. Blows the high heat past him. That's a strikeout. As we go to the top of the fourth. Now here is Cattell Marte. Cattell Marte. Here comes a pitch. 
So now That's the hard-throwing right. left-hander Josh Hader on the hill. And when oh, you look one. at the start of Hader's career, pretty incredible. Oh. Arguably one of the top beginnings to a career for any reliever in history. Ripped to short. They get the yeah. out on Marte. Fastball grew right down the middle. Usually a lot of damage done with that pitch. A hard grounder, but he wanted to get that ball in the air, maybe drive it into the gap. Miller right, at the plate fun. for the third time as he comes up empty there. Oh, one. Wouldn't chase oh. that time. Hater at times can have some trouble with command, but it's that fastball slider combo that is so impressive. And no one can get there. Around first and hustling for second. In safely. It's a double and his second hit. Now batting. The left fielder. So up next, Taylor, Taylor Trammell. Trammell. One for two. And first offering is fouled off. Man at second. Oh. And Good another one. ball. In the air, left side. Hanniger sizing it up. Squeezes it. Runner tags it second. Actually, he'll stay put. And there are two outs. Eugenio Suarez up to the plate now. He's over one. Pop foul out of play off to the right. Runner at second, two down. Top half of inning number four. Just no, off ball. the inside edge. Ball. Squirts away a little bit. No advance. Good job behind the dish. Swing and a miss. Two and two. Two and two. Chases in the dirt, slider there. In time. So the drop third strike doesn't hurt him. And we're back. Here's the former MVP, Jose Altuve. The pitch. Bunch attempt, but that goes foul. You know, this group of hitters definitely being aggressive at the plate, but I think it's fair to wonder if they're being a little over-aggressive. Right. I'm specifically talking about the first pitch. Oh, These batters two. are swinging more than 80% of the time, which is fine if you're scoring runs, but that hasn't been the All case right. today. Got it by him for the K. The batter, number 15. Here's some Good real day power day. at the plate. Kyle oh. Seeger. Seeger. This one rip, but foul to the right. 0-1 now. He swings and fouls one off. One down, base is empty. Gets a piece, and it stays 0-2. Stays alive. And a pitch. Fights that one away, and the count remains 0-2. And, and the righty deals. Knocks that one away, and we'll do it again. Well, having such a tough time putting him away. Six foul balls in a row. Man, hey, what a hey. bat. Caught him looking for the K. Now the pitch catcher. Garver up to hit here. Garver. Got it started a little too early. Strike oh one. Next that offering missed. upstairs. One and one. Two down, nobody on. Comes strike up empty. Two. That's strike two. One and two is the count. Two outs. Foul ball still a one and two count. And a pitch. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Ready now for the fifth inning. Anthony Rizzo steps to the plate. Anthony Rizzo. Hater back to work. A little bit high. 
and it's one to no. Well, these players really impressing me with the quality of their bats in this one. It's been fun getting a chance to nope. see them go oh. to work. It looked to me like they really wanted to get to the starter early, get him out of the game before he settles in. So I'd say oh. mission accomplished. And that's Rio. downstairs and outside. And a four-pitch walk. Boog, if I were him, I'd be nibbling around the plate as well. I mean, this guy is just capable of hitting pitches outside of the zone and driving them a long way. Kendall Graveman gets handed the rock out of the pen. And with the big deficit on the scoreboard, he almost has to just put that out of his mind. Every outing matters for relievers and their numbers, but I think it's tough to get up for this type of appearance the same way you would for one in a close game. Hammer down the line. Could be extra bases. Rizzo, round second on his way to third. Throw comes in. Runner stopped. Second and third. Nobody out. Oh, I'm sure he feels really good about that one. Against good pitchers, you've got to take advantage of the mistakes. That was right in his wheelhouse, and, and he didn't miss a stitch. And up to the plate comes Cody Bellinger. Just oh, missed. This is a situation where the hitter is looking for something up in the zone that he can get his arms extended. What you have to be careful of is that pitch that's up, that's in on your hands. That'll pop you up in the infield, and that's exactly what the pitcher wants. This one in the air right field. Gets under it. He's got it. Both runners tagging. The relay puts the tag He's on out. him, and it's a double play. Next is the DH, a switch hitter, Jamer Candelario. Right ah. through there for a strike. There's a swing and a miss. This guy's got such a good sinker. As a hitter, you've got to look up in the zone. If you look down, you're going to be chasing stuff in the dirt. One ball, two strikes. In the dirt, but kept close. And an excellent job keeping it right there. Kicks and fires. And that one got a piece of him. him. He had him 1-2, and he ends up hitting him with a pitch. Here's the power hitting catcher, Mike Napoli. And first offering is fouled off. Two on, two outs. Up and oh. in, and it's one and one. Had a no, good eye there. The Tough spot right here. A couple runners on. Two, two ball, ball count. Strike. You can't nibble, but you have to execute and finish your pitch. If you leave something out over the plate, it's going to bring in some runs. Peek. Swing Ouch. and a miss. Struck him out. Slider got him for strike three. Bottom of the inning. Now it's the right fielder, Tim Salmon. The right fielder. A wind and a pitch. Here's a swing and a drive left field, and he knew it. That was blasted to the moon. It's 8-2. Jacob Wilson will hit next. 0 for 1 with a fly out. That yeah. one finds the zone. It's 0-1. Well, these guys just lacking discipline at the plate in this ballgame. Chasing pitches has been a big part of the story. We've seen it quite a bit to. today. It's been tough for them to make contact at times, and it just doesn't look like they're seeing it very well as a group. And on the mound, you know confidence has to be pretty high with all of the swings and misses. He's had them eaten out of the palm of his hand pretty much all game. One run across in the frame so far. Last half of inning number five. Suarez you know. throw to first in time and that's the first out nice recovery after giving up the homer and a foul ball one down base is empty and he swings and lifts one to deep center field puts it away for the out. Daniel Vogel back at the plate. The 0 for 1 so far. Vogel back.
And first offering is fouled off. Swing and a foul straight back. Swings and misses, struck him out. And welcome back to the ballpark. Now here's the switch inning power threat, Cattell Marte. In there at the knees, strike one. Graveman, a righty that throws with power, 32 years old, and he was drafted no, in the eighth the round back in 2013. And the pitch. Foul back our way, and that's out of play. One, two now. Down to the dirt, swing and a miss. Garver on to first. In there safely. Well, maybe approaching this at bat with a bit too much determination. Sometimes you just got to let the game come to you. And first offering is fouled off. Inside one ball, one almost got him. And it's fouled away. And a one two. There goes the runner. Pitch is low. Throw to second and he's out. Swing and a miss for the strikeout. Garver down to first and it beats him for out number two. That's a strikeout. Now Taylor Trammell. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Two down, nobody on. And we're at the top half of the sixth. Right-handed reliever. And it That's is two and one. And he grounds one to the right side. Altuve slings to first. And that is bottom of the six. Here's the center fielder, Ricky Henderson. And he deals. Ricky first pitch swinging. Boog, over 80% of his strike. first pitches are strikes. You're doing that. You could have a really good day out there on the mound. Puts a bunt down. And that's one out as they get the leadoff hitter in the sixth. And here comes Carlos Correa. And first offering is fouled off. When a guy's throwing a lot of first pitch strikes as a hitter, you got to be ready to hit. Now, that's not going to help you get deep into his yeah. pitch count and into the bullpen, but you got to take what he's offering that day. And here it comes. Base is empty one away here in the bottom of the sixth. Got him. Two down. Jose Altuve up to it here. He's already homered here in this one. Foul ball. Two down. Nobody on. Ah. And he blows that one by him at 100. 0-2. Oh Foul ball still 0 and 2. Two outs. Swings and misses on the fastball. Top of inning number seven. Now the third baseman, A. Eugenio Suarez. Righty reliever out of the pen, oh, Jose Leclerc. Whoa, well, they need whoa. someone to stop the bleed and keep this score right where it is. Seems like a tough task today with the way this lineup is swinging it. And the pitch. That one ball. misses. And that is one ball one. In yeah. there at the knees. The pitch. 
right yeah. through there for a strike. Nothing but curveball so far in the at bat. Kind of makes it difficult as a hitter to know what to look for right. because you start wondering if he'll keep coming with it or if they'll try to speed you up. And here is Anthony Rizzo. That one oh, is upstairs. LeClerc. A very difficult guy to get hits off of. It's really rare for teams to string stuff together against him. He wins every pitch. And for a hitter, sometimes a victory is just fouling off one of his pitches. At the belt and fires. And there's ball four. Four, four. four pitches. That's an easy walk, man. He could have walked me right there, Boo. The last one wasn't even close. Here's Byron Buxton. This is oh. again five in a row. Unless he beats himself, somehow can't find it, doesn't have the control command that day, yeah, you pretty much forget about it. Rizzo one, one. over at first with one away. As a hitter, there's even more pressure to take advantage of any mistake, right? Yeah, and you're hoping that, you know, somehow, some way, whether it's a hit by. And it's caught for the out. That swing right there tells me he's seeing the ball pretty well. I know it didn't produce a hit, but he made solid contact, and that's all you're looking to do anytime you're at the plate. Bellinger oh, stands man. in here, leaves that one off the inside. In the air, left field. Hanniger makes the catch in and go. And we're back. Now it's the DH. Kyle Seeger. Now pitching. Adam Ottavino. The pitch. Swing and a miss. Looked off balance that time. 0 oh 1. Swings through that one for strike two. No ball. Two strikes. The pitch. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Pulled the string on the changeup. And now the catcher comes up to him. Mitch Garver. And there's a hit. Well, that started and ended pretty quickly. No messing around right there. That's about as textbook as it gets. Got his stride and load out of the way early. He stayed inside that ball and squared it up out front. Man, that was like he was in the cage hitting off a tee. Righty delivers. And that one fouled off. That missed inside. Two. Gonna count one and two. Cuts on it and misses. That's a strikeout. Had him way out front of the slur. Swinging a foul back. That's out of play. And yeah, that's, that's outside. And one and one. Garver leads off first with two down to the inning. In the dirt. One, two. And the runner stays where he is. Righty to the plate. That one oh. missed. Right. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Ready to begin the eighth. And now the DH, Jamer Candelario. Pitch. And no, this is inside. Wouldn't chase no, that down. time. Ball. Kicks and deals. And that's Ball. off inside. the inside edge. And now 3 and 0. Oh. That just nope, missed. He walked four. him Runner on four base. pitches. And next will be the cleanup hitter, Mike Napoli. You know, I think he's okay with that outcome. It, it wasn't an no intentional ball. walk, but he wasn't exactly ball, trying no to attack strike. the zone either. Here comes a pitch. Can't oh. find it here. That's six straight balls. Just that off the outside ball. edge. And that's ball three. Three and oh. And a pitch. And a foul ball. 
Rudder at first with no outs here. Outside, and that is ball four. Well, interesting. He went with the off speed and walked the hitter. Man, you got to challenge the guy with the fastball. Here's Cattell Marte. Drilled to right, way back there, and that is gone. And they add to the lead. It's 11 to 2. Next to hit, Brad Miller. Raleigh now, Fingers takes over on the mound. And we all know about his slider. It's just filthy, man. And one of the better ones in the game, I'd say. Spin rate's very high, and it just breaks a ton. Nobody on, nobody out. And we're in the top of the eighth. Pitch misses there. And now it's even one and one. Hard ground ball, base knock. Oh, this has been a really nice game at the plate for him. He looks locked in. There was nothing cheap about the way he got that one through the infield. That was ripped, caught out in front, and didn't get under it like he would have liked, but definitely put a good swing on it. This one in the dirt, and the runner holds. Left-hand hitter waits. The punch out there, and there's one away. So digging in, A. Eugenio Suarez, 0 for 3 with three strikeouts. First That's pitch doesn't find the zone. Miller, the base runner at first with one out. And oh. another ball. And a pitch. Lifted in the air, right center field. Henderson on the move. Makes the catch for the out. Out number two. So, man aboard, Anthony Rizzo digs in now. That one catches the zone. Strike one. Swing and a miss. He's in a great spot right here, ahead in the count, 0-2. All four pitches in play right here, partner. Hacks and misses. It's and welcome back to the ballpark. Now the left fielder, Mitch Hanniger. Emmanuel Clothe. And here it comes. Swing and a miss. And that is strike one. It's 0-1. Fought off foul. Kicks and fires. And down on strikes. And that's the first out. So up next, Daniel Vogel back. And first offering is fouled off. Base is empty one away. Here in the bottom half of the eighth inning. Ripped on the ground a second. Marte throws the first in time. And a couple of quick outs. So the lineup flips over. And now the center fielder, Ricky Henderson. A swing and a miss, and that's Your strike one. Strike. And Peace strike two. Top. Just Ball. misses with that one. Really good slider. He's up there just hoping that it ends up Put swing three. and a miss. We go to the ninth. Here's the center fielder, Byron Buxton. Raleigh back to work. And that's oh, outside. outside. Ball one. Raleigh measures six feet four inches. He features a sinker, a slider, a fork ball, and he works in a four seamer. One and one. Late on that fastball. It might be time to one, choke two, up two, a little bit, get that front foot down early, maybe even just spread out. He's really late right now. That's the ball. Pitch misses, and it's two and two. Right-handed reliever. Bounce to third. Sends it to Vogel back. That takes care of Buxton. Bellinger up to hit.
Ball oh. one and a pitch inside. Swings and misses. And a count one and one. One and one. The one one is fouled off. Base is empty one away here at the top of the ninth. Next nope, offering low, is down ball. low. Ground ball right side. He'll do it himself. Oh. Two up, two down. Two outs, base is empty. Digging in, Jamer Candelario. One for three. Foul ball there. Well, two outs and a chance to put up a zero on the scoreboard here, and that's not something that's come easy for this staff in this one. That misses one the zone. Strength. And a count one and two. Swings through that one. It's a strikeout. We head to the bottom of the ninth, and now Carlos Correa. Now pitching John Franco. As he turns on the rubber, and with that good live arm delivers. Bunting, and it's in the air. On the run, sends it over to first. That takes care of Correa. Jose Altuve now at the plate. Well, he gave the bunt a shot there, but not able to execute. Yeah, I think he rushed it a little bit. Oh, and one. when guys rush, it can be a pop-up or can be bunted right back at a position player. And that one hammered. That's back. It's out of here. Another homer. He's done it again. His second homer of the game. It's 11-3 at the play. Kyle Seeger snags it for the second out. It's never fun going back to the dugout after hitting the line drive that finds a glove, but you will get some high fives. You know, when you make great contact, you feel like you've done everything right. But in this game of baseball, not everything is in your control. Lifted to left center, way back there, and that is gone. A gigantic blast. It's their second home run of the inning. It's 11-4. Now it's going to be yeah. Tim Salmon. Swings through oh, that one. one out in front that time. Base is empty, two away, but two runs are in. Here the last half of inning number nine. Nope. Ball. And now one and two. One that and turns two. out to be a really good take right there, but you don't want to end this game with the bat on your shoulder. One strike away. And oh. another ball. This guy's a fun guy to watch taking it bat. He just battles up there. He doesn't take a pitch off at all. Makes it so difficult on the pitchers out there. You can tell they get frustrated with how long it takes to put him away. Two down, nobody on. Still two and two after the foul ball. The wind of the pitch. Foul ball, another 2-2 two -two upcoming. The wind to kick the pitch. Off the no, mark that's there. It, that's the Counts full, three and two. Really good Counts take, full. especially with two strikes. And a swing and a miss, and that is the ball game. Final score in this one, 11 to 4. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew here at MLB The Show, thanks for stopping by.
Now, here is Ricky Henderson. The center fielder, Ricky Henderson. The wind of the pitch. Not wow. close with that one. And that's how this game gets started. Not Two even and close there. 2 and 0. Oh. The pitch. Bunch it towards the mound. Throw on to Freeman and a quick out number one. Now Correa. Up to hit. Outfield playing very deep, not wanting anything over their heads. And first offering is fouled off. And the right hander deals. Pitch one misses, and, one. and that's ball one. And right. a swing and a miss. Good late sink on that fastball. Out of the hand looks so good, and then by the time he gets in the hitting zone, hard to get the barrel to it. Three. Swing and a miss, and he struck him out. And there's two away. On the north side of Chicago, John Chambi and Chris Singleton. Here's the former MVP, yeah. Jose Altuve. Swing Your and a miss, blew it by him at 99. Next oh, yeah. offering is in for a strike. No ball. Two outs, base is empty. And That's one and two. It's a good take. Tries to hold up, appeal to first, and Woody Keller right on it. Says he held up. Rick. And a swing and a miss, and that's that. Freddie Freeman up to the dish. The wind of the pitch. Freddie Freeman no, delivered a master class in 2023. Freeman and Betts fed off of each other's success, and it helped Freeman produce a 977 OPS, 29 home runs, and more than 100 RBIs. That's a great season. And Ricky Henderson to grab, and there's one away. Joseph Ortiz, the next to hit. And a foul ball. Swing and a pop-up foul out of play off to the right side. That'll find the stands. One down, base is empty. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. Here's Nicholas Castellanos. And a foul ball. Here comes the 0-1. Ball That's one the ball. there. One one. Shot, 
just no, that's missed. It. That's the ball. And a pitch. That one fouled off. Two and two. Back to the mound. He's got it. Sends it to first. And Castellanos is out. What a play. Inning over. Back here at the friendly confines. New inning getting started. Here's a big power threat. Kyle Seeger. The right-hander back to work. That one fouled off. A healthy cut, tough pitch at 98, but a really good pass at the ball. And a swing and a miss. Down on strikes. Looks like he's picked up right where he left off. Mitch Garver up to hit here. And strike one to the catcher. 0-1. Up and oh. in, and a count even one and one. One. one out, base is empty. Outside. Oh. Pretty easy to give up on that pitch right there. Started on the edge of the plate with the spin. You know it's going to finish well off the plate. Right. A little out front there as he swings through it. Two and two. Two two down. Three Got tops. him swinging. That is good. And now the right fielder, Tim Salmon. Tim Salmon. And first offering is fouled off. Two outs. And a swing and a miss there. Wow, no fair right there. I mean, that slider didn't move to the very last moment. Incredibly difficult to pick that up. Got him swinging. He chased the changeup. Here at Wrigley Field, we head to the bottom of the second. Now here's Nolan Jones. Blanco back to work. That one That's missing it. inside. Oh. Well, he's so great about hitting the ball the other way. He gets those arms extended. So right there, just trying to straighten him up a little bit so he doesn't have as much outside plate coverage. And he makes the catch. One up, one down. Here's Sean Murphy. Swing and a foul over the screen and back out of play. One down, base is empty. That clips the corner. That one to first, and he grabs it in foul ground. On the ground to the left. Jumps, throws. Awesome That's play it. there. Michael Young will hit next. First pitch misses. And a big swing and a miss. He got away with one, one, one there, three. but he knows he can't go into that spot very often against a guy like this. This one in the air. Vogel back under it. And that is that. Out of the third inning. Here's the third baseman, Jacob Wilson. Jacob. The pitch. And he bunts, but that's a foul ball. Wilson goes six feet, three inches, hitting seventh in today's lineup. Usually a short stop, but today oh. starts at third. Here's a 1-1. One, one. one thing he has to remember is that he does not have to cover as much ground. So those balls to his left, remember that you got a good shortstop that can make the backhanded play for you. That Here one almost here. got him.
And now the count filled up three and two. Right hander kicks deals. Gets a piece and stays alive. And misses, struck him out. Now batting Mitch Hanniger. Right hey, through there for a strike. Top of the third, no score. Up and oh. in, and that's ball one. And it's strike two. One and two, count. One down, base is empty. Got him swinging for the strikeout. Seven in a row by way of the K. Here's Daniel Vogelback. Vogelback. Sharp grounder. That's through for a base hit. And that extends the inning. So the batting order turns over. Ricky Henderson digs in now. Swings and misses. Strike one. Oh, one. Check swing. Did he go? Yes, he did. I went through. Two outs. Puts a bunt down. Fires over to first. And that is the inning. Back here at Wrigley Field. And now the shortstop, Jerry Hairston Jr. And the right hander back to work. Gets him to chase after that one. It's 0 and 1. Breaks his bat and pops it up. Blanco makes the grab one away. And here is Brenton Doyle. Chris, he leads the way with the best batting average on the team. There's a strike. 0-1. Right side, hard hit. Vogel back. Takes it to the bag. And that quickly, two away. And now it's Kiebert Ruiz. He's a catcher by trade, but the DH here in this one. He swings and fouls one off. And that's off the inside edge. One and one. Base stock center field. And that keeps the inning alive. Man, those are the types of hits where you don't feel any vibration in your hands whatsoever. Such a good feeling. That's about as textbook as it gets. Got his stride and load out of the way. This one blasted the other way. Down the line, and it's a foul ball. And the righty deals. Two gone, but the go-ahead run is at first. Here in the last half of the third. Comes up empty as he chases that one in the dirt. On to first. In time, the 2-3 strikeout ends the inning. And we're back. And now Carlos Correa. Now the right-hander ready to go. Still no score. And there's the strike. They'll try to bunt for a hit right there, and you can tell he's trying to get something, anything going offensively. The shortstop oh. takes the ball. And a pitch. Yeah. Way out front for strike two. Clearly was sitting on a fastball right there. It just ended up out in front of the slider. Hey, you can't fault him for his commitment. Now he's just going to have to battle with two strikes. Got it by him for the K. 
Jose Altuve up to hit here. Struck out swinging his first time. Ball one, no strikes. All tied up. Top half of inning number four. And he deals. Swings and misses. It's a ball and two strikes. Hit hard, base hit. So a man aboard now with one away. Couldn't have timed it up any better than that. Other than ripping one into the gap or blasting one over the wall, there aren't a whole lot of hits that are more satisfying than a nice line drive in the center field. So that definitely felt good. Runner, Altuve runner. runs. Swings and blasts one deep to left center. Long run into the gap. Drops into the glove. Throw over to first. Throw behind the runner and they've got him doubled off. Ready to go, bottom four. Now the batter now, Joseph Ortiz. Here comes a pitch. Just oh. missed. You know, this group of hitters, as this game goes on, have to be more disciplined at the plate. They're chasing a lot of pitches outside the zone, and those chases that are turning into a bunch of outs, can they turn that around and stay within the zone? Yep. We'll see, but I think they have to. Altuve slings to first. One out in the bottom of the fourth. Castellanos batting with one down takes a strike base is empty one away we're here in the bottom of the fourth that one ripped Henderson going back pulls it in on the warning track Stepping in the long ball threat, Nolan Jones. Fly to left his first time. Swing and a miss as he was late that time. 0 and 1. Righty delivers. That one misses the zone, and it's one and two. Swung on, popped up on the infield. Vogelback settles under it. He's got it, and that'll end the inning. And welcome back to the ballpark. All set for the start of the inning. And here's the catcher, Mitch Garver. Perez back to work. Ah. Well, these players, as you probably oh, noticed, what? haven't been shy at the plate at all. In fact, they've probably been too aggressive at times. They're swinging at more than 70% oh. of the first pitches they've seen today, and, and it's one. just not working out for them. The pitch. And there's a foul ball. So those first pitch numbers tell me they should try to find a way to slow this game down a bit. Things have been moving just too quickly for them at times. Misses. No, that miss, that's and the count's even at two. Ah, Chases the fastball up the ladder, struck him out. Next to hit, Tim Salmon went down on strikes his first time through. Right through there for a strike. One down, base is empty. Oh. Recognize that changeup right out of One the ball, hand. Just strike. spit on it. And that oh. one upstairs. He really committed to that fastball up at the top of the zone. He knows that if he makes a mistake in the zone, it gets hit hard by a power guy right. like this. That's a nice miss right there. And down on strikes he goes. And there's two away. And the batter now, Jacob Wilson. 0 for 1, he struck out swinging last time.
Freeman hauls it in to end the inning. We head to the bottom of the fifth. Here's the power hitting catcher, Sean Murphy. The pitch. That's a laser base hit. So a runner aboard to start the inning. First pitch swing in, went up there with a the plan now, to be it. aggressive. I could watch base hits like that one all day long, and so could every hitting coach in the league. Just a nice yeah. line drive in the center field. In the dirt. Oh, one. Nice job behind the plate there. The pitch. Center field. Henderson moves under it. And there's one down. Jerry Hairston Jr. getting ready to hit. He popped out his first time. And there's a the ball. ball. One ball, no strike. Up and in. in. And now 2-0. and oh. Two balls, no strike. And oh. another ball. A rare three-ball count here. He's been throwing strikes all day. Got to be ready to hit if you're in the box. There's a strike. All in this count. Runner not known for his speed, but I think you got to put him in motion. Try to avoid a double play here, though. He's making things difficult for himself right now out there on the mound, but, you know, his confidence should still be high enough to get out of this, but he's going to have to buckle down right here. Doyle in the box now. Take strike one. Well, in this situation with runners on, you've got to get ahead in the count so that you can dictate the rest of the at bat. Nice job right there. At the dish, One, looking two. to lift the ball in the air in this spot. Anything but the inning, inning double play, boo. Two on, one out. Three. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Gassed it right by him. Next is the designated hitter, Hebert Ruiz. And fouled off. You know, he can move the ball around, add and subtract, get some weak contact at times. So... You don't worry as much about him in this situation. Very capable of getting a ground ball. And getting... Well, that's a strikeout, and that'll do it for the inning. Back here at the friendly confines. Leading off, Mitch Hanniger. And a pitch. A bit behind with that swing. It's strike one. Hanniger measures six feet, two inches. 215 pounds, yeah. a former first round pick back in no 2012. Right. And a pitch. Ah, that hit him. It. And the leadoff man is aboard to start the inning. Oh, looks like it got him in the forearm. Not much padding in that spot, so we'll see him tatted up tomorrow with the bruise, likely. Making a move at first, entering is the pinch runner, Mike Cameron. If he were an average catcher behind the plate, I'd say to run around the goal. Pitch misses. Well, I'm sure the skipper not happy about that right now. This is a big moment in the ball game. Big bat at the plate as well. If you're gonna go, you gotta be 100% sure you can be safe. And here it comes. Nope, ball. Good one. Bounce to the right. Sneaks through. Base hit. And that turns the lineup over. That's back-to-back -back singles for him. Just one of those seen eye base hits through the infield. He just kind of rolled over on it a little bit, but sometimes those can find a hole and get you enough. So a change being made at first base on a pinch run, base. Kyle Lewis. Number one, Kyle. And Ooh. here is Ricky Henderson, runner on the goal. And there's no throw. He's in there at second with a stolen base. Way high there, and it's 2-0. As a pitcher, you know the runner on second is ready to push things with his speed. A base hit's probably going to be a big run, so you really have to execute on the mound. That's out number two. Yeah, that was a wasted RBI opportunity, but 
competitor like him, he is looking forward to making up for it in his next at bat. Looks like it'll be a pinch hitter, Brett Harris. Looking for a two out hit with a runner in scoring position. Swings and misses. That's strike one. No ball, one strike. And that one hit 97 on the gun. No ball, two strikes. 0 and 2 now. Got him. Third out. Here at Wrigley Field. Well, we go bottom six. Here comes Freddie Freeman up to hit. The why to kick the pitch. Late with the swing there. Well, these guys just lacking discipline at the plate in this ballgame. Chasing pitches has been a big part of the story. We've seen it quite a bit today. It's been tough for them to make contact at times, and it just doesn't look like they're seeing it very well as a group. Swing and a foul straight back. And on the mound, you know confidence has to be pretty high with all of the swings and misses. He's had him eaten out of the palm of his hand pretty much all game. Line drive. Fair ball. Now he'll turn for second. The throw in. In safely with a leadoff double. Go ahead runs in scoring position. Now it's the second baseman, Joseph Ortiz. Next offering popped in the air. Right field. Brings it in. Runner tags it second. Now he decides against it, and he's back in at second. Nick Castellanos at the plate now. Looks like they want to set up the double play. Intentional walk will make it first and second with one gone. Nolan Jones now at the plate. These fans don't like to see that because they showed up to watch him swing the bat, but this team does not want to let him beat him. Well, all eyes on the double play ball in this spot. No better way to get out of this inning. Swing and a miss. 0-1. Oh, one. Oh, one. Strike one is so critical in a bat like this with a real threat at the plate looking to do damage. In the dirt. Nothing oh, happening on the bases, though. Two on, one out. On the ground, could be two. Wilson over to second, and that's two. And we're back. Top of inning number seven. Here's the second baseman, Jose Altuve. The wind of the pitch. Swing and a miss as he was out front that time. The 0 2. Bunted back towards the mound. Throw on to Freeman. And they get Altuve for the out. And now here is Kyle Seeger. Swing and a drive. This one is crushed. No doubt about it. And here in the late stages, they have the lead. He sends it out of here. Just like that, they move in front. It's 1-0. Here's the catcher, Mitch Garver, who's 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts. Foul back our way, and that's out of play. One out, base is empty, and a run in here in the top half of inning number 7. Swing and a miss as he was out front. One down, base is empty. Gets a piece, and it stays 0-2. Right back to him on the mound. Tosses to first, and that is out number two. Tim Salmon, the next to hit. 
Fought off foul. Two down, nobody on. That one, one not one. close. And the count is one and one. Good eye no, right oh. there. There's ah. a strike. Two outs. And that one ripped to left. And it stays fair. Now he turns and heads for second. To second, pulls him off the bag. He was all over that one. Solid double down the line, and that was a pretty decent pitch that he just turned on. Not really out over the plate. It was inside, but he was more than ready to get that bat through the zone. Hammer, base hit. Rounds third, headed for the plate. There's the tag. They get him, and that's the inning. And welcome back to the ballpark. Set for the last half of the seventh. So here's Murphy now. Blanco back to work. Swung on and fouled off. And he'll need to do bad. Changing speeds has this lineup completely off balance in this one. We've seen a lot of missed time swings, and it's been a challenge for these hitters to get their rhythm right. Looking to get the tying run on base. Swing and a miss, and he chases that one in the dirt. Garber on to first. In time to get him, one away in the strikeout. Down to third baseman, Michael Young. Outfield deep here, trying to prevent anything over their heads. Tapped at the plate, but it's a foul ball. This pitcher's done a good job of disrupting the hitter's timing with the mix of pitches and changing speeds. You want to keep that front foot inconsistent for the batter. Their swings are hesitant, and that's exactly what you want on the mound. Kicks and fires. And that one fouled off. And the right-hander deals. Swing and a miss. That one in the dirt. Ow. Two away now after the drop third strike. Jerry Hairston Jr. will hit next. He's old for one. That's off the mark. One and oh. This one in the air. Martinez in position. And puts the squeeze on that one. And that ends the inning. Back here at Wrigley Field. And now... Mike Cameron. As he turns on the rubber, and with that with live arm delivers. Swings through that one. Going one. Inside just missed. One one. Kicks and deals. Fights that one away, still one and two. The pitch. Fouls it off, still one and two. And the pitch. Got it. First out in the top of the eighth. So digging in, Edgar Martinez getting his first appearance here in the eighth after entering off the bench defensively. That one down the line takes it himself. Two up, two down here in the top of the eighth. Back to the top of the lineup. And now the center fielder, Ricky Henderson. Henderson. 
Bunch it straight back to the mound. Throw on to Freeman, and it's a 1 2 3 inning. Back here at the friendly conference. Finds. Here's the center fielder, Brenton Doyle. Yeah, the right hander back to work. Swings yeah. through that one for strike one. Trying to keep no good ball. speed off the bases. That misses. No, that miss. That's ball. And one and one. Home plate umpires trying to tighten things up a little bit. The pitch. Swing ah. and a miss. One and two is the count. Fly ball to right. Makes the grab, and there's one down. Next is the DH, a switch hitter. Hebert Ruiz, one for two. Right through there for a strike. Well, and a bat can be a little bit of a dance. Strike one here, but a few more pitches. We'll see how it turns out. One down, base is empty. Keeps the at-bat going with a foul ball. He's gone off speed. He needs to elevate here with two strikes out of the zone. Right side. And there's two down. Maybe caught that one off the end just a little bit. Couldn't quite barrel it up enough to really drive it. Stepping in, Freddie Freeman. Line drive, and that should be extra bases. Around first, heading for two. And the tying runs at second base with a double. Seems like he got exactly what he was looking for right there. Kind of an interesting pitch selection. Yeah. To the mound now, they turn to Blake Trinan. And we all know about his slider. It's just filthy, man. And one of the better ones in the game, I'd say, spin rate's very high, and it just breaks a ton. Now a chance for Joseph Ortiz. Balls, one strike. Trying to hold a one-run lead here in the bottom half of the eighth inning. High fly ball out to center field. Henderson moves under it, brings it in. And that is the inning. Here at Wrigley Field, here's the shortstop at the plate. Brett Harris. Brett Harris. Now pitching. Dead y'all. The pitch. Upstairs. That's not, that's ball. Bard, a 6 4 righty. He features a sinker, a slider, no, a four seamer, it. and he works in a changeup. Hey, right through there for a strike. Next hey. offering is in for a strike. Well, don't expect too many more high fastballs. This is a good sinker ball pitcher, and sometimes they can make mistakes trying to pitch up in the zone. Look for him to stay down around the knees to be effective. Goes down, swinging for the strikeout. Murphy gathers, oh. throws the first, got him. One away on the strikeout. Now it's now the back. second baseman, the Jose second baseman. Altuve. Not one close with that one, and that is ball one. Drops one down in front of the plate. That's and a foul, ball. foul ball. Not two even one. close there. And a count two and one.
One run game here in the top of the ninth. Cuts and misses. It's a strikeout. Kyle Seeger digs in now. He's already homered in this game. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Not looking like they'll be adding any insurance runs heading to the bottom of the ninth, so it's going to be on the bullpen to hold this lead. Foul ball. Two down, nobody on. And now two and one. Left hand batter waits. Spoils that one and it remains two and two. At the belt and fires. Still two and two after the foul ball. Fouls that off to the left and will do it again. Two outs. Swung out, belted. Deep. That one went back there, and that one's going to land not so much here, but here. A massive home run. His second home run of the game, and they add on. It it's 2 nothing, And now the catcher comes up to him. Mitch Garver. Foul ball there. And now the one. This one popped up. Murphy brings it in for the third out. All set for the bottom of the ninth. Now here is Nick Castellanos. Okay, look, we'll see how it factors in. I just can't emphasize how much that insurance run in the top of the ninth means. I mean, just such a big difference mentally when you're chasing two runs instead of one. Righty to the plate. Late on that fastball. Well, that's today's style of baseball right there, right? Big time velo on the bump and big time pop at the plate. Got him swinging. A huge out to start the bottom of the ninth. So now it's the four hole hitter, Nolan Jones. The other way. Whips it across. Hey. And a couple of quick outs. Now so it's their last Murphy. chance in this one. John. Sean Murphy getting ready to Murphy. hit. Hey. And there's the strike. Two run game with two away here in the bottom of the ninth. Now one, one and strike. one. They're down to their final strike. Just not able to catch right up to that velocity. Trying it is just one strike away. Puts it in the air out towards left center. Ball game. Well, Summon from the bullpen had to come in, get a big out, and then had a little time to think about it before he went back out to get the final three outs of this ball game. Nonetheless, outstanding job to get the save and secure the win.
Hi, everybody. It's Book Shambi. Welcome to the show.